everyone, welcome to Short Clips TV. I'm Alamide Salah, better picking with better voice. You know, tattoos and multiple body piercing has a long history and is well known in various cultures like in Africa, America, Asia and Oceania. But there is this popular belief and this popular saying that people with tattoos and body piercing are irresponsible, irrelevant, wayward and sometimes for the ladies promiscuous. But is this the truth? Join me as I ask Nigerians their take on tattoos and multiple body piercing. Let's do this. What's your take on body piercing and tattoo? Okay. Actually, I know that um, we Nigerians, we live more like uh, the Westerners, like the Univos. It is not um, something that is outrightly responsible. But these things, are we feel it like it's an addition to our beauty or thereabout. Some people are so crazy about fashion. I myself, I wouldn't do such. So I, I would not advise anybody to do so. Even if you are to do the one that is not permanent, you can use like all this mark and well, let it be in an eating place, something that you can easily clean. And you know, this it, it disqualifies people if they want to join the army or they try to do some things that they don't allow their piercing, they don't allow tattooing of the body, and it costs a lot of money. If you know these things is not totally acceptable, I don't know why people keep wasting money on it. To me, I feel it's nothing, it's like it's a mindset, it's a perception. So I don't take it. If you like, I, I'm, I'm not saying it's actually bad or good. It's people's mindset. You know, our Nigeria, yeah, we take things like our own mentality is different from the, from others like the white people. So me, I don't see anything wrong with it. But if you have a different reason, piercing, that's your own business. But me, I actually like it. To me, it means nothing. But we as black, because something black mentality. Whenever we see someone who is having that kind of that or piercing something. They'll think that person, the first that comes to mind is a bad person. But that doesn't judge who you are. Some of his, some of them is responsible, okay. some they're not responsible. Some just put just because my friend have done it. So some put it because he already making it. As for me, just a fashion, something that's not okay. fashion. Okay. Okay. There's nothing wrong with it. Okay. Okay. The artist. Okay. That's the impression I always have. Oh. I feel that not, that person is not responsible at all. Okay. Okay. Yes, it's not responsible. This person is responsible. You cannot push it. You cannot do anything on your on your body now. Why? You don't need it. I don't look at them as criminal, but to me, it show irresponsible. I don't notice anybody that has piercing. I just see you. I see a human being. I do not look like okay, this guy has piercing. He should be this person or he's like this. No. If I see anybody on piercing, as a matter of fact. I don't even see the person. I see you first. Okay, I don't even see the person. So I don't think it's anything for me. It doesn't portray whether somebody is bad or good. You know good now? Okay. Maybe the person don't get brain touch. Then uh, maybe the person, he, he don't, he, he is sick where where. So anybody who draw a tattoo for body, okay. he gets sickness for body mm. where where. But it's not where discipline from the, uh, their home. Mm -hmm. If it's a child very disciplined, he cannot put cattle and earring or plait her hair like a woman. Okay. Uh, and so women to put it on their bumbo, mm. uh, which is very bad, and breast, what are they showing? We, where, where are we going to? Uh, it doesn't show any discipline. Maybe the person is a froster or not really very that responsible. Bad person, but those are not. But in first mind, that is bad person. Uh, once I see a person that have tattoo, first of all, I look, maybe it's artist okay. first. Second, some of people like tattoo just as a fashion thing. Uh, to me, just like as my artist said, uh -huh. uh, if I should say the truth, maybe it's artist, okay. maybe it's a designer, maybe it's a movie director or anything. Maybe it's in the entertainment but, industry. Yeah. Body piercing is a bit nice, but okay. tattoos, no, like, literally, I see you as a dog. A dog, that's just it. My take on it as a Christian from the religious perspective, 
piercing of the body and painting the body is is not normal for human beings. To me, it's animals that you can pierce like a pig, you pierce the nose. Even in the olden days, you pierce the nose of your pig if you want to sell it for a higher price. Uh -huh. Then you can paint, um, uh, if you have a pet, you can start to paint it. When I was growing up, it's chicken that they usually paint so that our neighbors may not steal it. But for a human being coming to paint the body, pierce the nose, the eyes, some even pierce their tongue. To me, it's very, very abnormal. It's not, it's not a normal thing. As soon as I see the person, I, I feel like this person has started drinking or something. Piercing does not define a person. So me seeing somebody with multi-piercing, I, I love piercing too. So it doesn't define a person. That kind of a person, I don't count that person is a serious person. What came to my mind, maybe that person is, is, is maybe a person is in one society or the other. In civilized countries, they don't, they don't, they don't look at that that much. Like they don't, they don't see that person as a bad person. But when you come down to Africa, they see anybody with piercing, tattoo, dread, as, how will I put it now? Not, not even criminal, as evil doers. Like this person is um, is a worldly person. Like a pastor now cannot pierce in this side. A pastor cannot draw tattoo. But if you go outside the country, US, you see stuff like that. I've seen a pastor with dread, plating air. I've seen a pastor with tattoo. They look at those people that they are not somehow responsible. Because a responsible man will not go and draw tattoo all over his body. And then to draw different things on his on his on his face, uh, to come and show the public that this is the group I belong. So personally, I don't buy that idea. It's not righteous. Like the Bible says, we should not draw any image on our body. And what I think is like that person will go to a fire. <laughs> so that is just what I used to think. Like it's not godly. It depends on the individual reason. You understand some maybe it's fashion, mm -hmm. some maybe the tribe or um, different reasons behind it that you can't say. Uh -huh. So now it depends on. For me, I don't see anything bad in it. It's an individual reason, but I don't have any. That doesn't mean that it's bad. Can you actually marry a man that has tattoo all over his body? Oh, no, is it no, no, no? Capital no yeah. for me. Where the tattoo is placed, it trust with <laughs> in his face and his arms, like everywhere, print pronouns. I won't accept it. I'm sorry. I'm not against it too. But for me, I won't accept it. Like, but the person is actually nice. I like the one in the nose. <laughs> but I won't do it. What I really if I will marry this a such girl, what really matters most is her attitude and behavior. Okay. To me. No. Ah, but you say some of them are responsible. Because if I study her that I know that is responsible, okay. Okay. maybe okay. I can go ahead. Okay. But if I study is not responsible. I can't go. It doesn't matter now. Since you don't have any issue like any sick, a sickness or disease in his body, I don't have any issue with it. Yeah. I wouldn't like them to marry anybody that has tattoo. Neither with their hair scattered up and down, you know. No, I don't want that. Forbid. I would never allow my child to marry such person. Ah, no, 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 no. No, no, no. You don't even think about it. I've been seeing this thing, but I don't like it, honestly. If I see somebody that has tattoo on her body and she's the kind of person I want oh, and uh, she meets my my own standard for, for a lady, why not? Impossible. I love you go to my mama now. Okay. My mama will accept herself. It happened that to my own child. Get that type of lady. You say you want to marry. I say, I say no. It's not a well trained. That's the thing. Yeah, it depends on my own lifestyle. Maybe if my lifestyle... You know, it does encourages somebody like that. Yeah, it's okay because it's not everyone that is um that likes this sense. So I'm like, you know, being radical. So if I like a girl, if I see a girl with piercing and tattoo, it depends my choice. Then your choice then. But you now, 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 would you marry somebody like that? No, because it's not my kind of lifestyle. But if it's only me, if I like it, I will marry the person. But because of my family, I can't. Why not? Once once we get love with each other, we marry right. everything. So tattooing is not... It's not anything. Yes, but it gets on my need. Shake it. Okay. 
It's not that it's some people that used to draw some stupid thing for body, but some used to draw, draw something or writing some make sense. So that is all. Yes, of course, an artist, I will. No, multiple pairs, no, but if it's just maybe one or two, yeah, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I will chase that person with, <laughs> with knife. <laughs> yeah, sure, as long as he loves me now. Okay. And he can take care of me. He doesn't cheat, he doesn't want my knife. Fine, I'll go. When you come to ladies, what matters is character. Mm. The personality of the person. Okay. Manner. It's not the tattoo or the piercing that matters. Someone with tattoo might have good that more than someone with the without a hair tattoo. And someone with piercing might even be a nice person more than the person with that uh, piercing. I would disagree. That child will go and marry that person on his or on, on his exactly. pocket, yes. I didn't pray to marry a man that have tattoo. Oh, okay. But some people like it, but me, I don't like it. Although if I see it, I used to like it, but I didn't wish like that person should do it. Okay. If your child, maybe 15 years old and upwards, says, just wakes up one morning okay. and says he wants to have tattoo and piercing all over the body, what would you do? Anyway, I'll, I'm not going to cane him or I will not be shocked. The reason is, these kids are smart. Yeah. They watch TVs. They have friends. They even discuss among themselves. The only thing I would do is to just accept. I would find out why. Then I would advise him about it so i will just let him know these are the implications first i'll let okay this when you do it it may look handsome it may add to your unique your handsomeness but it is not advisable and i'll give him reasons why he shouldn't do it i want to advise him to go for it trust me i like it but i won't allow my child to do it that's your life that's your, that's your life you allow that sure you know i allow it <laughs> you know i would think i'm autistic but no i allow it <laughs> They mad. <laughs> they're not born now. I'll, I'll beat him. Uh -uh. You say there's nothing. There's time for everything. There's time for everything. Okay, At least you guess yeah, the level that you start all the fashion of it. Okay, okay. But I won't let that happen. Person not to. What I don't like, I don't want my children to do that. And uh, if you do it, I may disown you. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, that's <laughs> I will disown you because I don't know what is happening in this modern world. Uh, is something different from what's yeah. happening in our own time. This modern world, I don't know. They say that digital, we are analog. I think analog is better than digital now. Because they, 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 with what is going on, I don't see the future in this country. A lot of things are going bad. See the type of crime they are committing here and there. Just young ones want to make money quickly. So it's a very terrible situation in the country. Very terrible. So one have to advise his children. If you want to go towards that way, like my own child bringing a car to, uh, tomorrow to show me, I must know why, uh, how you get the money to get the car. But today, many people, parents don't ask. But I personally, I can disown my own child. If you go out, uh, uh, if you go outside my way of life, I will disown you because I have a name to maintain. I don't want anything to destroy my family name. Ah, hey, I'm going to deal with them. They must not try it at all. Okay, okay. Even ah. I will disown them to try it. <laughs> hey, they dare not even try it at all. No, 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 no. I will tell you as a father that I don't, I don't need it and I don't like it. Okay. But if you didn't tell me I do it, I will not kill you because you've already done what you in your mind. It's simple, simple and straightforward. You just have to sit down with your child and talk to the person. Why do you need that too? Why do you want to pierce your ears or your nose? Why do you need those stuff? If they give you good explanations as to why they need it, why not? Well, if they don't give you tangible... If they give you good examples, I mean, good reasons to pierce their nose or draw that on their body, you as a parent now will explain to them why probably they don't need it or why it would be good on them. Disown him now. And you will not even think exactly. about it. Yeah, I won't think about it. I won't even hesitate to disown him. Uh, I will not like it. I will, before God and man, I will like to disown him mm. or her. Yes, he's supposed to follow you. It's good to take your children to church anywhere to have a words of God and all that things. I mean, it will be homie, all these things. Yeah. Uh, you see a child, your own child, devoted to another thing, which is not good. I will not, uh, I will not accept that. Uh, because it's not my lifestyle, I won't want um, my child to go to that direction, except he reach at the age of, you know, reasoning or he, he but for me, within the age um, of my control, he, can, he or she cannot do that. I can't allow this. I can't, no, I can't. I can't allow it. As far as me concerned, 
No problem, because it's my ways, man. <laughs> Nothing more than to tell her that uh, if if this is what you like to do, although I have been on this live, I have said a lot of things, but I will I will question her that you know that. Let's take it in Bible. Okay. You know in Bible that Bible do accept it and not much like that, but I will I will not say much than say to allow them to do it. They will never try that. <laughs> Me being a parent, my child will never do that. No, I won't allow it. <laughs> <laughs> it should better not happen because okay. uh, no no it should not happen it should not i don't even want to think of it <laughs> my male will not pierce but if it's for my female even me i have it in mind to pierce for my daughter mm. you know giving her like two o's okay yeah okay. two no why yes. why she decides that she wants to do the tongue but Is that on the, her own yes I don't know. It's when she gets to that yeah, age. Okay, you know, okay. it's a choice now. Okay, me too. Okay. Someone gave birth to me. I grew up. I decided to pierce my ears. Okay, so it's a choice. It's a choice now. So I can't tell her not to do it. As long as she's not prostituting, I'm cool with it. I will, not, I will not accept that kind of a thing because I don't believe in all those things because I believe that people, many people that are putting kind of tattoo is on her body. Okay. I didn't count that person as a human being because I, I believe that that person is in one secret sick, sick society or the other. So I, I can't tolerate nonsense at all. I don't I don't have, I don't I cannot even encourage my, my son or my daughter to to do it. But it's not the right it's not the right thing to do at all. You are talking about a child. I've seen a newborn baby. Like uh, I would like to put it now, like four months, five months, six months. And the parents already pierced like three O's mm, on that wow, child's ear. Wow. I saw that on social media. And people were commenting somewhere like, it's cute. Somewhere like, ah, she's too small now. Why make a decision for her? But that's what they want. So if a child is going up and the child is having interest in that kind of hair, uh -huh, to me, oh, you wait on the child, know what is good and what is bad. Uh -huh. Then the child will make up sure. But... That age is too young. My child will not even tell me because it depends on the brought up of the child. Mm, because a, a child gets spoiled when the parents are, we, we don't look after the, the child. Mm, they don't true. care of what and what the, guy, the child is, is doing. Okay. So for that reason, I don't think my child will even tell me that. I'll, I'll be the last person to, to take that. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I, did, Jesus. <laughs> I did pray for that to happen. But if she wish or he wish, I don't know. I don't know what to you know say. What to <laughs> and do you know? And that thing depends on the kind of tattoo you want to press on your body. You know, it, each of them have different meanings. You understand me? So, if you're going for that bad one that signifies like, well, it's the devilish something or that aspect of it. So, I don't think um, I can allow you go for, go for that. You understand me? So, and depends on the level of the child. There's how a child will grow up. You can't like enforce on certain things. Is this on her own choice to do? Do you understand me? So I will train him up or her to a particular stage. I know. Do you understand me? And um, by God's being faithful, I, I you should be able to inculcate that, telling him or her that this bad. Do you understand me? And that's why that's still where I go back to that my first day thing. I can't tell you that this bad. Why your why my wife has it? Do you understand me? So that means my half shouldn't. Do you understand me? So now for my child to still insist. He or she wants to go into it. If he's up to age for it, he answers for himself. I will not be the one to enforce. Do you understand me? So you are in modern world. You shouldn't enforce your child on his choice. But that should be when he's up to age to give account of himself. Oh, I can't. But you said there's nothing bad in it. It's an individual reason. Okay. Do you understand me? I don't have it because I don't. I don't want to have it. Seeing a woman, well, I think well, what love cannot do doesn't exist. So it depends on the love in it. You understand me? Ahead. So if I truly love her, I can go ahead. Yeah. There you have it. Even from the mouth of Nigerians, some are just against it. That it's, it's, it's not of God and it's not from the Bible. And some are saying that there's nothing wrong with it. It has to do with personal views and personal experiences. Well, Personally, I think that for some is rebellion, for some is just a fashion statement, you know, to change your looks from time to time. And I'll just say that every tattooing and every piercing comes with its own risks. You know, infection is out there because of the tools that have been used. 
Well, I'll just say that be careful if you actually are involved or want to do it. Be careful to go to anywhere you're going to or who you're going to meet. Make sure they are professionals and make sure their tools are always sterilized. Thank you for watching our videos. To get more interesting content like this, don't forget to subscribe and also follow us on our various socials at Facebook and Instagram at Short Lips TV. Also, we have an anonymous website where you can also we have an anonymous website where you can share your real life experiences and connect with people who have been in similar situations like yours. Just go to www.shortlips.com www.shortlips.com This is Short Lips TV. I'm Alamide Salah, better picking with better boys. Till we come your way next time, do stay safe.